my 1983 300D for sale. Um, came straight off the boat from Germany. That's the uh, original tag uh, that came off the boat from Germany. I have every single service and maintenance receipt from 1983, including uh, a transmission fluid change in Germany before it came over here. Um, all original. Um, I do have the numbers matching transmission uh, that comes with it. The transmission finally went out and I did replace it with a uh, brand new transmission. Uh, so the numbers matching transmission comes with it. Um, no damage or anything on the body. Uh, wheels were repainted um, and they look great. Um, also put a tent on the windows. Um, And uh, I have some stickers on the back of it, but you can, of course, I'll remove those if you want me to. Uh, just some local bands. Uh, easy to remove with a hair dryer. Um, also tinted the back window. Um, trunk comes with the original um, caution triangle. Um, <clears throat> has the spare tire. Um, uh, this is just some stuff I have in the trunk. I also have a fire extinguisher. And here's some, you know, random stuff you need to carry in a Mercedes. Like there's extra pre-fuel filters, some gloves, some extra hoses. This is just like a, you know, roadside kit for typical things that you would have to replace on a Mercedes. Um, has some gloves in there. You know, some napkins. Um, little little screwdriver and wrench to put the fuel filters on. Um... Also just carry some diesel additives. Um, you see everything's immaculate back here. Um, not sure what else to say. I mean the car is in outstanding condition. Um, show you the inside. Let's see if I can turn on my light. Um, not a rip in any of the upholstery. Absolutely beautiful. All the interior lights work. Um, carpet's clean. Door panels, outstanding condition. All the windows roll up and down. Um, have these aftermarket floor mats. The originals are underneath here. Um, the dash is in immaculate condition. Um, all the gauges work. Um, there's an aftermarket radio, uh, and the air conditioner has been converted to uh, you know, a modern air conditioner. Uh, runs on the correct, what is it, R134 or whatever the number is. All the lights work, visors work. As I said, not a rip anywhere in the upholstery. Perfect, mint condition. Um, Front windshield has a lighter tint, um, you know, so it makes it easier to see out there at night. Um, let me show you the engine. I'll go ahead and crank it up. Turn the lights off so the buzzer goes out. Let me get the keys here. So we have your standard glow plug light that comes on. See, oil pressure is perfect. I just drove it. Uh, so the engine temperature's up. Um, RPM gauge, clock. Oh, I'm sorry. This one, yeah. There's the clock. Clocks. Everything works. Um, <laughs> horn works. All the uh, air conditioner and heater um, uh, thermostat controls work. I don't know if you can hear it, but there's the auto auto on, auto air on. Let's go look under the hood. See if I can open this with one hand. I'm gonna have to put the phone down for a second. Um, all of the rubber has been replaced. All new rubber hoses everywhere on the vehicle. Uh, it was actually fine. I just wanted to replace it to make sure there were no problems. 
Um, the uh, fuel return lines uh, from the injectors have been replaced. Um, you see how clean everything is. Um, all the rubber connectors here from all the vacuum lines have been replaced. And um, there's no blow-by on the engine. You see the cap doesn't pop up off of there. So there's no engine blow-by. It runs very strong. And uh, it's got the original hood mat, auxiliary fan. Everything works perfect. I take very good care of my cars. This is uh, probably the nicest 1983 300D you'll find. Now the paint is also the original paint. So I don't know, what's that, 30, 35 years old, something like that. Um, so if you look closely in the paint, I don't know if you can see it in the camera, you can see little checking um, under the clear coat because it's the original paint. Um, but yeah, it really doesn't get much nicer than this. All of the window seals are very good. Everything seals tight. The only sign of anywhere in the car is right here. That, that started to come off a little bit. Let me just tuck it back in there. Okay, there we 